And it is time for another round of zero hours, zero cup ELO matches. This is a match between Team Zcot and Team Dr. Dobbs. On Team Zcot, we have TGF, Spoopy, Zcot, and Farab. On Team Dr. Dobbs, we have Robin Sage, Hi Dad, Gloomy, Clummy, and uh, Doubled. On your leaderboards, you have Zcot on top with 168, Joe in second with 112, Grim with 109, Robin Sage with 90, Dr. Dobbs with 72, and Glummy in sixth with 54. Cut up. Five of your top ten leaders in this match right here. Hi, Dad. Starting with a frag, Robin Sage with an armor utility doubled with the wedge. Glummy going with the frag, and Located the attackers the will go with Zcot on the frag. TGF, fair of taking that scar. Everyone's going to go assault with the frags here. Up here, we have Hotel Trouble. Hotel Trouble is one of those vertical maps. Fair, I'm going to play the long haul. While everyone else repels. You've got two defenders on the stairs. Doubled is watching that long haul. Does like to check that out. Fair will have teammates join him on his left. Double just happened to look away at the moment that the long haul is being crossed. Now all of Team Zcot is in front of Doubled. Hi Dad will help. Glummy's going to sit in the room across the hall. He's in the middle. Team Z-Cop might be in for a surprise. Glummy has that door closed. Supporting the frag is doubled. Who comes back in to try to pop shots? Hi, Dad. Sees their shots going from down below. Oh, that frag is going right for doubled, and he will get taken out by TGF's frag. Farab still at the end. Hi, Dad. Watching the long haul. Shoots over to where Glummy is in position, taking out Smoopy the whole time. They had no idea. He's there. Glummy will take out TGF. Robin will take out Zcot. And Farav, who started this fight, will have to end it. Gets a couple of foot shots. Glummy's going to push in with the f flashed Farab. Not sure if Glummy's actually flashed himself or... If he just didn't want to push. Farab has sight again. Glummy will peek right. Farab takes out High Dad on the ground. And Glummy will peek out to take out Farab. After one round, Team Dr. Dobbs will take the first point. And the remaining survivors have virtually no damage taken. TGF and Farab will get a kill each. Glummy with that massive takeout in the middle hall and then finishing the job with Farab. Wow. Robin Sage will also pick up one. Nearly 400 damage for Glummy. Use the planning table to find the bomb. High Dad has the MP7 and the frag. Robin Sage will do the same except go with armor. Doubled. That was the AK and he has the wedge. Armor for Glummy. And that is the MP7. He's going to go for the stairs. Hi, Dad will watch that hall. Robin Sage is going to take care of the balcony. Doubled. Looking for a position. We'll probably look at that balcony as well. He will. Zcot coming in with the frag, followed by TGF. Farab is going to climb up on the rappel. Spoopy is also joining Zcot and TGF. Farab taking the long haul again on the fourth floor. Hi, Dad, looking. He will only get a peek. Oh, everybody's in this room. Zcot takes out Doubled, who is sitting in behind the bed. Robin Sage takes out TGF. Spoopy takes out Glummy, and Zcot takes out Robin Sage. Farab still watching that hall. Hi, Dad. Also looking. It is now Team Zcot in room 304 with Farab pushing up. Hi, Dad, on his own on this defense. And he will push up to room 304 where he will meet everybody. And they will greet him to take him down. It's tied up 1 1. 
Everyone on Team Zcot has participated in some way. And for Team Dr. Dobbs, Robin Sage is going to pick up two kills there, or a kill. To start round three, we're going to have that same room 304 objective. Hi, Dad is maybe looking for a place to put the C4. Doubled has a C4 as well. He has already placed it. Glummy will place the sticky cam in room 304 looking at the balcony. Maybe they don't want to be in sight of that balcony this time around while Robin Sage takes the room across the hall. That would be room 303, I believe. Yes. For the attackers, it seems like nearly all of them choosing the same emergency entrance except for Farrah who's going to take his usual spot. He might actually, he sees the shadow and he is going to get some pre-fire. That is, looks like it's going to be by Glummy. Farab and Glummy are now at that door. They'd be figuring that Farab needs to get taken out to have a successful defense here. Farab only with a kill, but the position is not comfortable. Zcot taking out doubled. Oh, Farab has a good shot to catch the curling high, curling high dad, but Glummy takes out Farab. Now it is down to Glummy, who takes out, who takes the scar, and Robin Sage, who's across the hall, looking at the balcony to take out Spoopy. In the room, he oh, gets taken out by Zcot. Glummy is now in a good sight to take out anyone on the bomb, but TGF will pick out Glummy instead. Team Zcot winning the last two rounds. And will now have to defend against Team Dr. Dobbs, who only found success in the first round. Team Dr. Dobbs, Glummy and Robin Sage, the only ones really doing work at the moment, or rather being effective. Everyone was pretty much in the heat. For Team Zcot, Zcot is going to go ahead and get five kills there. Only getting picked off once. They're going to start in the second floor conference room. Zcot's going to have armor. TGF will have a frag. Farab will have a frag. And Spoopy will have armor. 50-50 between armor and frags. Looks like Zcot and TGF will control that first platform where the cafeteria is. Farab is going to watch the hall by the stairs. Spoopy's going to take care of the balcony. While High Dad comes in the emergency entrance with Robin Sage and Double Sage. Glummy's already... Taking out TGF. Glummy repelling up. Zcot is still up there. Glummy might find a new position. Doubles on that balcony. No one's watching that anymore. Glummy and Zcot right across from each other. If Zcot pops up, which he has no reason to right now, he might get a good shot here. Glummy sees Zcot. Zcot a little late on the shot, but. He's more accurate, taking out half health from Glummy. Glummy's going to drop back down again. Zcot only down about a quarter health. Hi, Dad takes out Spoopy. Hi, Dad's going to work the bomb while Zcot is stuck in the cafeteria. And Farab's still on the balcony. Farab will be taken out while Hi, Dad is still... Oh, he's going to go back on the bomb now. He started over. Zcot is now going to push in. He probably gets the information that they're working the bomb. Robin Sage and Doubled watching the halls. Zcot still has to push in. He will not get there in time. Well, hi, Dad. Ties this up. Too even. Four. Team Dr. Dobbs. Doubled and hi, Dad. Picking up a kill each. Well, me on five now and Robin Sage on three. Lummy doing a lot of damage for Team Dr. Dobbs and Team Zcot. A lot of work being done by Zcot and Farab. Farab not able to complete a lot of his damage, but still doing damage nonetheless. Zcot with the MP7 and armor. TGF with a frag. Farab's going to go with the MP7 and a frag, and Spoopy has that 
wedge, which he has not found a position for yet, okay. and the MAC-10. Looks like he's going to wedge that door while Robin, Robin Sage pushes in from emergency with Doubled and High Dad. Doubled had the C2. Glummy's in position, looking at the cafeteria, looking for a repeat where Zcot was there. Zcot is still watching, but now from a different side. He definitely heard the repel, but he just doesn't know where. Spoopy takes out Doubled. They are on the balcony. Hi, Dad's going to hang around. Hi, Dad's going to push in. Hi, Dad in a gunfight with TGF, and TGF will win it. Robin Sage stuck on the stairs. Glummy stuck hanging out. He will pick a safer route now that his team is down two players. Both Robin Sage and TGF have, or Glummy have full health. Robin Sage takes out Farab as Farab tries to get the door open. TGF only has five health and Not exactly sure how he died there, but he did. Oh, by Robin Sage. Robin Sage just had the name, yes. Wummy shooting across the hall with the scar at Spoopy. Robin Sage. He will look across to see if anyone's going to come up those stairs. No one will. Because Zcot is in the cafeteria. Spoopy is just going to wait for the backside while Glummy starts to push in now. Zcot will be in a good position to see this if Glummy decides to peek. Glummy and Zcot are now encountering each other again, but now from a different angle. Well, almost encountering each other, rather. Zcot's backing up. He's inching. Now he sees the door. Immediately, like, quick, fires over there. Starts laying it on Glummy, and Spoopy will take out Glummy instead. Robin Sage was going to go up the stairs and probably regretting it now that Glummy's down. Robin Sage will go back to his original stairs that he was on. Zcot's still going to be on the main stairs while Swoopy is waiting to hear anything going on at the other end. Robin Sage might peek. Well, Spoopy is looking. Spoopy goes back. Robin Sage using Glummy's body for cover. And now he's peeking out there. Oh, Spoopy. Almost found himself in a bad situation. That'll be enough information for Zcot to set up, waiting for Robin to peek his head out. Less than a minute left. Robin Sage has to take on Zcot and Spoopy. And they will just fire in. Spoopy will. And Spoopy will now fire in to take out Robin Sage, who pushes in at the vending machine and gets taken down. Team Zcot. Get another point here. Finding a way to score. You have Zcot with 554 damage, Spoopy with 548 damage. Farab's up there too with 410. For the attackers, Robin Sage and Glummy having five kills each. Doubled and High Dad have Use not the table to find the bomb. had such a good match so far. They've definitely had better. But they still have the ability to come back into this. We have Farab going with the flare and Spoopy going with the sticky cam, but someone else had a flare too. That was TGF and Zcot. Three of them going with flares. Interesting choices. Looks like Zcot okay, wants to watch cool. that repel. It's going to be Robin Sage, High Dad, and Doubled, while Glummy is going to come up. Zcot is going to be waiting for it. He sees the repel. Oh, and the slide up. And as Glummy bounces up and down, Zcot takes out Glummy. They seem to know where to meet each other. Doubled and High Dad getting on the side of the balcony. Robin Sage will get on the front of the balcony. Uh, 
My dad will continue to hang off the side. Double will move on the rear building stairs. Robin Sage peeking up where it seems like TGF is sitting there. Zika and Farab are in the hall. Spoopy. Sitting through the door. Doors opening on the left on the lower floor. Zekot not ready for that. Zekot's just caught in the middle between two doors. Good sink between doubled. And I believe that's High Dad on the other end. Yes, it is. High Dad's in the perfect position. He's got to take the shot. What just happened? That was Farab? That was Farab. I think High Dad now sees. That's spoopy, but TGF will now push in, and Double will take out TGF. Double is now going to see where High Dad was shooting, and gets taken out by Spoopy. Farb still in the closet. Spoopy on the door. High Dad still popping shots. Where Spoopy is? Well, Robin Sage pushes in from 304. Farb is coming out of the closet now, and he's going to go ahead and fire the stairs where... Nobody wants to say hi. Robin Sage is going to start working on the defuse while Farab and Spoopy will now have to rush to push in. It's going to be too late for them as High Dad is in a perfect position to take him out and the bomb will be defused to tie this game up 3-3. Three to three. For the attacking team, Zcot at 7 kills now. Spoopy at 5. Lots of damage between the two of them. And for Team Dr. Dobbs, Plummy and Robin Sage with five kills apiece. I told you that High Dad and Doubled are capable of waking up, and they both pick up three kills together. The planning table to find the bomb. We have Doubled with a wedge. High Dad with C4, who will place it right next. Dude, that's a difficult spot to t for the attacking team to take it out. In ten seconds. Glummy's going to do armor, and Robin Sage will do armor, probably playing the roaming game. Hi, Dad. will take the fitness room down the hall. Okay, Double's going to put this wedge, I believe, look, that is on the balcony door. One of the hotel rooms on the lower floor, where the objective is. TGF, Zcot, and Spoopy are both going to take, or all three of them going to take the emergency entrance. Farab is going to go back to his long hall that he started with, long hall. Takes out the camera. And now the defenders will know there's some fourth floor action. But given their positions, we'll probably not care. Double just sitting out in the open hall, waiting to take out anyone who will challenge him. Spoopy has to work on the wedge while Zcot takes out High Dad. Seacott pushed in on the balcony side. TGF will go ahead and frag it. Doubled will get into a better position. Is now going to encounter Zcott. Zcott's in front of his face, but he can't seem to spot him as Zcott takes out Doubled. TGF. Ooh, let me take out Spoopy. TGF sees down the hall that Robin Sage is there, but Zcott will come in and take out that. Uh, take out Robin Sage instead. Glummy is now the only one left, crawling his way down the hall, looking right, but everyone's left. He is going to get caught with the frag in the hall. He's going to have to push up into that room. That will miss him. Glummy takes out Zcot in the process. TGF, a three health. Oh, this flash might even take him out. He's so low. And Glummy pushes in to take out everyone. Whoa! That just happened. Oh, that really just happened. If that is not one of the most impressive plays you see. Of course, we've saw it from the flash end, but the way everyone was positioned, there was just no way. And it just did. Use the planning table Unbelievable. The Team Dr. Dobbs. Now getting another point to have to be in match point position. Glummy with nine kills, nearly thirteen hundred damage. Deploying in ten seconds. And a lot. A lot of confidence. 
Hi, Dad, with the MP7 and the C4 to start this round. Okay, we're going to have doubled bombs. with the wedge and the AK. Robin Sage with the MP7 and the armor. Glummy's going to have MP7 and armor as well. TGF is pushing in. Who is that? It's Farab climbing up there, and he's going to get taken out by Glummy. Leaving the scar down on the second floor. Spoopy is going to come with the frag, as well as Zcot. And they will now have to push on the balcony down one man and no eyes. Zcot taking out High Dad on his way up. Even strength for both teams. Doubled is looking down the hall. Robin Sage is going to stay on that bomb while Glummy is in the room across from 304. TGF, Zcot, Spoopy. All in room 304. Now, TGF crossing over to 302. We'll shoot across the hall to 303. That's wedged. He'll be stuck there for a little bit. Zcot's going to keep watching that door while TGF tries to open it. Doubled is waiting. Glummy. He's going to try to do that mid-haul takedown again. Will Zcot remember that? Double throwing the nade. No one has really opened the door. Actually, Spoopy, they did get that door open, but they fell back. Glummy just waiting for the push. Might even be waiting, waiting for Double's call. Robin Sage is now inching out. TGF is going to take the point, throwing the frag down to Doubled, who gets Doubled. They do think that Glummy is in there again. And that will be TGF and Spoopy in position, this time not wanting to be taken out by Glummy. This means the match. Robin Sage prepping. And Glummy takes out TGF. TGF opens up that door and then ends up running right in front. Spoopy will go ahead and take out Glummy. Now it's Zcot and Spoopy ganging up on Robin Sage, who is on the objective. Zcot on the door, Spoopy checking the hall. Maybe trying to give Zcot the all clear or just some information as far as where he can rush in and point to. Robin Sage. He's holding his position, Zcot. He will now open the door. They are both going to play the peak. Well, no one is looking. They're going to close in on the objective, maybe anticipating that somebody might be on it. They have a minute left to make something happen. And uh, Zcot has that information now. Seeing Robin Sage underneath, he's going to toss the frag just to get rid of it. Because no one's going to be there. He's going to shoot through the door. And Zcot's going to take out Robin Sage with the frag. And this game is tied. It will come down to round number nine. The bomb has been defused. This is as good as it gets, guys. These are the last few rounds. These, these guys are tough competitors. Four, Team Zcot. Twelve kills for Zcot. Imagine that. And Glummy on the other side? With these two going after each other? Glummy's not far behind. Just one kill. Done more damage than Zcot, though. One thing about Zcot is he has not gone down as much. He's got the fewest deaths of anybody in this match. Double's going to spawn in with the AK and a sticky. AK and a C4 for High Dad. MP7 and a frag for Robin Sage. And Glummy will have the MP7 and the frag. They're going to go ahead and set up that fourth floor. Robin Sage is going to check out the stairs. As the attackers come in, we have Zcot. I believe that was the AK and a frag. TGF on the frag. Farab on the scar and the frag. He's going to try to go for his hall play again. Spoopy with the frag. And it uh, looks like that is... Who is that? That's Glummy. Glummy's waiting on Farab to pop out. Oh, and Farab just gives enough to be seen. And Farab's going to still try it again. Probably should have just given that up. But Glummy takes him out. No eyes on the long haul. Zcot, TGF, and Spoopy all on that balcony, pushing up to 304. 
TJF will be the first one to push in with the shotgun. High Dad knows. Robin Sage will check to make sure no one's taking the stairs. Double's going to watch the hall. Lummy's also waiting outside that room, deciding not to necessarily play in that room, but wait for them to come out. And Zcot ready to take out Lummy. Ooh, High Dad takes out Spoopy. TJF GF is now in the room. Pretty much alone in 302, but Zcot's next door in 303. Glummy's going to go ahead into that. Uh, oh, sorry, that is. Hi, Dad, that's in the room across. Remember that Glummy died. Hi, Dad is going to stay in that room while Zcot goes ahead and he's going to set up in the front lobby. TGF. Gonna try to peek high dad. High dad is gonna do some damage there. That is gonna be half health for TGF. E. TGF giving up on the shotgun. He's gonna try to pre fire with the pistol while high dad just sits and waits for the ammo to get bled, bled out. Zcot takes out, doubled. Zcot repelling up and then coming down. TGF does successfully get take out high dad. Robin Sage is on his own. He was watching the back stairs. Zcot's still on the second floor with the camera. They might know that. TGF in the middle of the hall, checking his pistol ammo. He's going to try to get another gun. He gets the AK off of High Dad. 25 health against Robin Sage's 100. If he can take out TGF right now, he can make it easier on himself to take out Zcot, who's approaching anyway. Robin Sage might have to take on both of them. TGF will peek, but he's not peeking where he can be seen. Zcot is also peeking now. He sees that the door is open. Probably feeling like someone might be in there. A minute left. They have to take out Robin Sage if they want to win this. Looks like TGF will maybe try to check out the neighboring guest room to make sure no one is going to come from behind them in case they're wrong about Robin Sage being in the stairs. TGF gets taken out confirming his location. Zcot now knows Robin Sage needs to move. He's going to get shot at, pull back, naded, and Zcot takes him out. That will be the match. Team Zcot will win this match on a frag in the stairs. Well-placed frag for the win. The bomb has been defused. 1,700 points of damage for Zcot. 15 kills. 3 deaths. Unstoppable, this guy. Glummy with 12 kills. Died in that last round. Was very effective for Team Dr. Dobbs. Very close match. And a lot of work being done between Zcot and Glummy. Holy moly, was that impressive. An update on our leaderboards. And Zcot is going to keep climbing up even further. Still in first place with 173 points for Glummy. He is going to remain sixth, but drop down to 51 points. That was amazing. All right, watch the whole leaderboards here. We'll catch you in the next match.